I'm Natalie Pinkham and I'm here at a screening in Leicester Square, the View Cinema, for The Lost Orphan, A Home for Morella. It's the second documentary following on from The Lost Orphan in search of Morella where I went to look for um, an orphan child who I connected with back in 1999 as a student volunteer. So fast forward all those years and the screening was effectively about a home that we've built for Morella who's severely institutionalised and um, has massive mental health issues as a result of years of neglect and institutionalisation. So I'm here with Hope and Homes. It's been an amazing night. So many lovely friends have turned up and yeah, I'm sort of buzzing a bit at the moment. I've learned a few things on this journey, but the most important one really has just been reaffirming what I kind of already knew, which is that family is everything. And by family, I don't just mean my mum, my dad and my brother, but of course they have been incredibly supportive. But I mean a much bigger family and that sense of teamwork pulling together because lots of people keep coming up and saying well done, congratulations. And it's sort of making me cringe a bit to be honest because I genuinely cannot take the credit for this project because it has been this huge collaborative effort. The wider family of Hope and Homes and the importance of family for people like Morella and other children that are in her position, what they need is love, what they need is togetherness. And that's what I've learned from this whole project. What I would love anyone watching the documentary on Wednesday at seven o'clock on Channel 5 is to go to the Hope and Homes website and just see how they can help in this process because what I'm really excited about is that this is a finite goal. There is a lot of work to do but it is achievable and I think together we can achieve the end of institutionalisation. Consign that word to the history books and get all kids into happy, loving family homes.